Yo, what's up fans? So we have started our journey. It is real late here and it's freezing. Hey! I didn't even want to talk about how long some tickets to get there. But we are on our way guys, so. It's gonna be a long ass trip. It's long enough doing these on your own. But when you've got three kids, four kids including me, I feel sorry for my wife, so. Love you babe, good luck. Alright boys, where are we? Where are we? At the bridge! Where, where are we? At the pool? Yeah. I'm so excited, this is the best place ever. What? What? Harry Potter! Thank you, Will. Oh, what's that? What the? Let's go! Yo, what's up fam? So, Next we were super keen and came super early, which means that we were the first thing, but nothing's open yet. So we've just got some coffees, and we're just waiting for everything to open, and we're in there. Now, I'm not too sure who's more excited, the kids or myself, because I'm a Harry Potter fan from way back. And I'm hoping to find me a wizard. I'm hoping to find me a wand today. And if people's wands go missing, I know nothing. But come along with me and the family today, guys. This is a different vlog. Just our family trip. This is my beautiful wife. Hello. Hi. Oh. Kaya. Where are you? So my wife just says to me, oh. I can't say no shit about this. <laughs> She's off walking up the aisles. <sighs> when you come here for this? Where's your main attraction? <laughs> so I'm giving a shit about it. It. Do you like it? It's Harry Potter for me. <laughs> you don't know Harry Potter? Never do you. Well, <laughs> Auntie does, and she told me the story. You know. Oh, don't. here we go. So, we're really enjoying our day today. We're only halfway through the tour. And, um. Oh. Wow. Hey, what do you need? What's that? Hey, oh, you push it down. How come you can't push it? Because I don't have strength. You don't have the strength. Who's the one who's been working for ten years and he got a whip while he's choosing his life? It's not strong enough, bro. Let me help you out, bro. You're supposed to help me, not talking. Feel that? I feel the power. That's called power. Power of your thumb. Power. Power of your thumb. If you need some, uh, if you need help again, because you're a baby, let me know. 
all right fams so uh, we've just finished up at the Harry Potter and I've just taken the family back to the motel to chill for a little bit um, I'm now off to a fitness spot that has hot and cold and a sauna because I need to get rid of this jet lag um, we got in late afternoon yesterday and I can still feel it now I'm not right so I need to be proactive and get in there and try and get my body ready to go so that's us we're on our way <sighs> fans <sighs> exactly what I needed I ain't gonna lie I don't even know what came out of me <laughs> but um I feel so much better already I definitely need to do this again um, in the next few days just to make sure but I'm glad I made that decision to come down and jump in. Not a bad facility too. It had everything I needed, so we're not long. Two days. Tomorrow and then game day. Let's get this body back, get it ready to go. Alright guys, spa is all done. Thank you guys. Um, I'm just waiting for my ride to head back to the motel. Um, as we do get closer to the comp though, I will be backing off from doing things. I think my uh, my wife's gonna take the kids to the zoo just to kill some time. Maybe tomorrow or the next while I start mentally and physically preparing myself for the weekend. So all is well. fighting the best I could and um, I'm just sorry that I didn't put on the performance for you guys today. But what I can do is give you love like you've given me love and I can share my culture with all of you. So today I would like to share with you a haka that is well known by the All Blacks. What do you say? So guys, I thought I'd jump on and just update you guys. Yes, I'm okay. Now, for all of you that know, um, to get here to a Drive's Love show has been one of the biggest goals of my career. And um, after last night, guys, I'm absolutely gutted. I'm absolutely gutted to what happened. Um, I work my ass off. I train for it. And to turn up and not perform has really, really hit me. Now, for all of you who don't know, a week ago my kids all fell sick. 
and I did my very best to look after them but also not get sick and I thought I'd pass that but as we left Australia to fly here I fell ill and with that 34 hour flight plan to get here really stuffed me over so the whole time I've been here I've been trying to battle this virus and get rid of it now I didn't tell anyone about it the only one that knew about it was my wife and my kids because I didn't want to make an excuse I didn't want anyone to think that I wasn't going to turn up so I did what I could to try and get ready for the show but as you guys can see I was not ready at all um, I feel like I've let a lot of you down I'm not performing I feel like I've let my family down I think it's just hard when you work so hard for something and it's just taken from you like that. And I'm, I'm still proud. I still turned up and do the best I could for, with what I had. But I just, I just couldn't put it together. And I, I am telling you guys, I fought with everything I have, but my body just wouldn't let me do anymore. So. I just wanted to jump on here and just let you guys know that I'm alright. Um, I'm back with my family. I've got to go and see a doctor this afternoon to check everything over to make sure I am okay. But um, there's a lot of healing that's got to happen from this. But um, yeah, I just wanted to update you and just let you know that we're okay. My family's okay. And. Um, Let's hope there's a next time. Alright, much love guys. The Warrior.